welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a little bit different. I'm going to be unboxing some friend mail. I've been collecting it for a minute now. It's just going to be a kind of chill sit down video where we're going to see what some of my friends sent me and I thought it would be fun to open it with you guys. So let's get into the friend mail. Now I have four little packages here. Well, three smaller packages and one big boy. And I have received these even prior to Christmas. So some of them may say Merry Christmas. So just, you know, we're I was saving them for a cold rainy day and it's not raining, but it's cold. So that counts for something. We're gonna start with the first thing. It is a card. The Withering Cottage, Kathleen Ann and Ariana. So I will have to give my mom her part of it. It is a Christmas card, but see, it says, wishing you all the timeless treasures of Christmas, the warmth of home, the love of family and the company of good friends. Oh, it's from MJ. Thank you so much, MJ. I will be sure to share this card with my mom. It's very cute. Thank you so very much. And Merry Christmas. Uh, only a little late. Only a little late. Thank you, MJ. This next package is from Heather from Antiques Agenda. I will have her channel linked in the description box below. She has an amazing eye. Very similar style to mine. I have no idea what she sent me. I wasn't expecting anything. Eek. Yeah. Oh, that freaked me out, Heather. There was a bug in there. Now, I love that, but it was a little spoopy when you don't expect it. Look, it like goes on things. We can put it on the X-Acto knife. Ta-da! Thanks so much, Heather. And she wrapped it in a beautiful little bow. Here is her little um, logo. And let's see what it is. Let's see what it is. I love presents. Gift giving is my love language. So receiving presents is fun too. Oh, and look how cute. And here is her card. Here's her information. If you want to check her out, I highly recommend it. And I got this little card. Ooh. Okay, I think I can read this one aloud. I wanted to do a little pre-reading just to be safe. So it says, Ariana, so when I was watching your New Year's video and saw that the one collection you were definitely still hunting for was flower frogs? Well, I knew your home would be perfect for these spiky treasures. Hope you like them. Sending much love to you, tiny human, Kathleen, and hubby. Thank you so much, though. Flower frogs. I love flower frogs. And look how cute. <gasps> these are good ones, too. I love, 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 love flower frogs. One of my favorite collections. This is a beautiful shape. I'll have to get all this um, paper out of here. Oh, I love this one. Thank you so much, Heather. That is so incredibly sweet of you. And I really like the patina on this one. These are stunning. Thank you so much. I love that oxidation on there. These would have been a lot of times submerged underwater. So they have this beautiful patina on them. I love that one. And then this one, these are some of my favorites because Crescent Moon is just, I think my favorite shape. If I had to pick a favorite shape and look how stunning. Oh, I love them. They are gorgeous. Heather, I seriously cannot thank you enough. Please be sure to go check her out. She's amazing, and I can't wait to add these to my collection. Thank you. Oh, and thank you for the bug. Thank you, Heather. Now, this next box doesn't have a outgoing name, so I don't know who it's from, but we will find out together. It is wrapped in purple tissue paper. It feels soft. I don't know what it could be. There is a letter. i read it. I'm gonna keep this one private, but it's from Birkenstock 
girl. Thank you so much. Very sweet. Let's see what it is. Oh my gosh, so I imagine this is for my mom. It's a lit, I think she make, did she make this? Let me see. So I don't know if she made it or just purchased it, but this is so cute. That is probably for my mom, for the Amelia B dollhouse. And look how sweetly she has vacuum sealed that. So incredibly thoughtful. And then she tie dyed these shirts herself for me and mom. Oh my gosh, they're beautiful. Look at how well she did. That is amazing. How did you get these little, these little lines? So one for me and one for mom. These are beautiful. Thank you so much for thinking of us and for taking time out of your life to make these for us. They are absolutely stunning. Thank you so much. And the last package is the big one. Now this is from Katherine Young. She is a good friend of mine. She's also a very talented YouTuber. Her channel is also linked in the description box below. And for Christmas, she sent me a mystery box. So this is gonna be really fun. Can't wait. I've been saving this. She has impeccable taste. So I am so excited. Sorry for the peanuts. I don't mind peanuts, Catherine. A mystery box, friend mail. So there's a card for me and a card for my mom. I won't open my mom's. Oh, look at her card. These are her design. See, this card was made for you by Catherine Young. I'm going to read this privately. But thank you, Catherine. Let's get in. Oh, I love it. I'm excited. A mystery box. Okay, let's see. This is the first item. I think it's a mirror. I see a reflection, sort of. And I haven't, I know you probably don't like the unwrapping sound, but I wanted it to be a true reaction. So I didn't cheat. I didn't unwrap anything prior. She is a very good wrapper. dimensional look at all those beautiful silk flowers that is gorgeous a little plastic hand mirror I won't show you your own reflection but that is absolutely beautiful thank you Catherine I love it I love it I love it okay what else what else is that we got another bubble wrap package a little probably hobbyist piece ceramic really cute thank you so much next up is this beautiful little box that she so lovingly tied up with a bow let's see what's in here oh it's packaged so nicely i think it's gonna be fancy what is it what is it I don't know where that went. Oh, Catherine, did you make this? I feel like you made this necklace. It is out of paper. I feel like you made this. That is so beautiful. Isn't that so cool? If you made this, girl, that is amazing. How fun, I love it, thank you. And it goes so nicely with the mirror. What else is in the box? Ooh, what are you? What are you? What, what, 
what, what? I know what you are. It's a pie bird. You know, before I started reselling, I didn't know what a pie bird was, but now I do. And here is one. You put it on your pie so that it doesn't get soggy. No soggy bottoms. They don't like that on the Great British Baking Show. But this is a really nice one. I don't know the maker, but it's beautiful. Thank you. I feel so spoiled. I feel so spoiled. This is so fun. I want to open vintage mystery boxes every day. I know that's selfish, but it's really fun. Ooh, these are beautiful. Look at these clip-ons. Aren't those gorgeous? Now these don't, you don't have to wear clip-on earrings as clip-on earrings. You can put them on your curtains. You can put them on your postcards and flower frogs. You can do all sorts of things with them. You can wear them on either side of your collar on like a button-down shirt. Those are beautiful. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, what else? There's still so many more treasures to behold. What are you? Yeah. Yeah. Oh my gosh. John Cope's dried sweet corn. It's corn. A big lump of knobs. It's got the tin. That is so funny. Look at this guy in the corner. That's John. Howdy, John. Thank you so much. It will, I'll put it, I'll wear it as a necklace with my corn dress. I'll make it into a giant pendant. Thank you so Let's much. Let's see what else is in here. I think I'm gonna take the things out of the box and then open them. Maybe I should've done that before. But you know, there's no planning in these videos. And they're biodegradable peanuts, so that's good. Oh, we have one imposter. How'd you get in here? See, the rest are biodegradable. Bad peanut, good peanut, but there's only one bad peanut. He snuck in there somehow. I think that's it for the box. Yeah. All right, let's go bubble wrap first. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh. It is so cute. It is, oh, I always draw ro, ro, Hondo. Something Hondo. Gosh, I feel so not smart. Roy, Roy. <laughs> Hondo. Little deer face. It's adorable. I love it. Thank you. Gosh, it's going to bug me. Rio Hondo. Maybe. Maybe not. Can't remember at the moment. Ooh, and a little glass bottle to put something in. That'll be fun to try to find what I'm going to put in here. Maybe some moss. That would be pretty. Thank you. Two more things. Let's go with this one. What are you? What are you? <gasps> oh, it's so pretty. I saw a pink. Look at this purse. Isn't that beautiful? Wow, look at the carving. That is beautiful. Smart. Made in the USA. These look great on your wall like this with like um. Like you put this on your wall on a nail and then you put something like this in there. Maybe not this one, maybe a flatter plant, but you get the idea. So fun, it's beautiful. Thank you, Catherine. And it's my favorite color. Beautiful, thank you. And we got a box and it's heavy. We got a heavy box. It's a crystal. Oh, wow, this one is beautiful. Look at that. The quartz crystals on one side and then the druzy on the back. 
Catherine, this is stunning. I love it. I don't know if it's rude or not to say, but this is my favorite thing you sent me. It's gorgeous. Everything is lovely and beautiful and so thoughtful, but I love this. It is stunning. Oh, I can't wait to find a, a new place for it. Thank you so much. Everything was beautiful. Thank you everyone that sent me um, something to my P.O. Box. You definitely never have to, but oh, it's so fun when you do. And I appreciate each and every one of you so much. That was so much fun. What a nice way to spend a cold afternoon. And just thank you guys for watching. And thank you once again for joining me at the Withering Cottage. Bye, guys.